Hello, hello, hello. This is your boy Brandon Karaya, aka Earfront of Entertainment, and we are back with another trailer reaction. And <laughs> do we have a big one today? The trailer we have today is Ant Man Quantumania, the official trailer. Now, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you think you would be interested in content like this, trailer reactions, movie and TV show reviews, entertainment news updates, specifically related to the movie industry, hip hop sports, subscribe to the Brandon Cryer Network. You will not regret it. Now I am very, very, very interested in this movie, not only because of the big bad villain that is going to be in it, Kang, but I'm really interested to see how this movie, because of that villain and because of the subject matter that they're dealing with, now that it's going to be more tied into the MCU, because if you look at Ant-Man 1 and 2, in a way, though, both of those stories are isolated in a sense and contained. With Ant-Man, Quantumanium, and Kang being involved, this is going to have major stipulations on the entire MCU. So I'm very interested to see if there's going to be a tone difference because the two Ant-Mans aren't my favorite or aren't in my top 10, but I enjoy both of them. They're probably middle of the pack MCU movies. And it's like middle of the pack at this point is still very good because there's 30 movies, but it's probably middle of the pack. Like I said, I enjoy Ant-Man 1 more than Ant-Man 2, but those movies are common comedies kind of with superhero stuff mixed into it. Paul Rudd is one of my favorite actors, probably in my top five favorite actors currently working. I love Paul Rudd. Not only is his comedic timing amazing and as a comedic actor he is absolutely amazing but when he needs to get emotional he's able to do that really well so i love paul rudd but yeah like i said the biggest things that i'm looking to see from this trailer is to see if there's going to be a tone difference from the other ant-man movies and how connected this is going to be to the rest of the mcu because the other two movies are more contained than i feel like this movie is going to be so i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited jonathan majors is killing it these days so i'm excited to see if they're going to reveal kang right from the jump or if they're going to maybe save him for another trailer. But that being said, let's get into this Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania official trailer. I used to ask myself a lot of questions. Scott, you're at X-Con. How are you an Avenger? That doesn't make sense. But everywhere I go, people tell me the same thing. Thank you, Spider-Man. <laughs> people still need help, Dad. That's why we made this like a satellite for deep space but quanta wait wait a minute you're sending a signal down to the quantum realm turn it off now janet would know best yo see these damn kids yo okay so it seems they all get sucked into the quantum realm Damn, this Where? looks sick. When are you gonna come down? When are you going to land? I should have stayed on the phone. I should have listened to my This looks mind. tough. This movie's gonna be visually amazing. What are you so afraid of? There's something I never told you. Saying she knows about Kang. This Janet. Place. It isn't what you think. I hear Jonathan Majors. Oh, I can get you home. Bill! Yo, don't get me no. And give you more time. If you help me. So, what's it gonna be? Batman. Jonathan. Ooh, the suit looks tough. Saying so he needs his help for something. Interesting. Yo. And my guy? February 17th. Yo. Very, very interesting. I want to start off by saying one shout out my guy, Bill Murray. I'm a big Bill Murray fan. So, I'm very, very excited to see that he is in this movie. Secondly, 
visually, this movie is going to be amazing. The Quantum Realm, how they're showing it and depicting it, it looks sick. We only got a brief touch on it when Hank went down to save Janet, but it really seems like they're going into the cities that are in the Quantum Realm and they look absolutely amazing. We do get our introduction. They revealed it was more of a narration at first, but then they did show him a bit up top on some kind of like floating platform and he looks sick when he was up there. And then obviously at the end of the trailer, we see Jonathan Majors asking Ant-Man for help. Not really clear of what us as the audience, obviously we don't really know what he's asking help for or what it's gonna lead to, but it seems like he needs his help for something. And maybe instead of them fighting, that's gonna be the crux of the movie is, is him actually needing his help to maybe stop a different variation of a Kang or something. It, it, it There's gonna be a lot of kookiness and just off the chains craziness in this movie honestly they're gonna get into some crazy crazy aspects i really feel like it because not only they're dealing with the quantum realm but kang that is really really centered in time travel and time control and time manipulation i'm really interested to see how those two things mesh together if they're separate things if the quantum realm gave him these abilities th there's so many questions i'm honestly gonna have this trailer didn't really put out too much about what the plot is gonna be just showed that ant-man's feeling himself because he's an avenger now and people know that he's an avenger and then they get sucked into the quantum realm because cassie builds a device that's basically sending a, a signal to the quantum realm and we see janet get upset it kind of crashes and it sucks them all in and that's when we get the craziness of the quantum realm and we're obviously briefly introduced to the visuals and into kang but they didn't really give too much about the plot oh and the shot of the city it kind of looked like a futuristic city that looked sick i'm i'm really excited to get into the quantum realm and to really see how they visually depict this next dimension in a sense so i'm very 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 excited for this movie very very excited for this movie because this movie could lead to a lot of things that's going to pop off in phase five because this movie is the first project to pop off phase five so whatever happens in this is going to influence all i i feel like all the other movies or at least the following movies kind of right after it for sure so that is it for my trailer reaction if you like this video hit the thumbs up if you think you'd be interested in content like this trailer reactions movie and tv show reviews entertainment news updates subscribe to the brand and cry network you will not regret it and let me know in the comments what you thought about the trailer if you're excited for ant-man quantumania if you're not what things you saw that that i maybe missed let me know in the comments if i missed anything because i'm really trying to know everything that popped off in this trailer so let me know in the comments what you thought and what you saw like i said appreciate you for watching catch you next time